Anthropologists at Notre Dame have been studying a strange new ritual from the Nazaremian Society. This ritual is known as Zilftin. The elusive nature of Zilftin had a huge impact on the Nazaremian Society, and we are here to figure out why it was so important. In the ancient times, Nazaremians spent a lot of their leisure time watching Zilftin. It is believed that Zilftin was their number one source of entertainment, and this caused them to become lazy. Many members of this society were addicted to their way of life, and legends say they could avoid the outside world for days. Before Zilftin was created, Nazaremians had lots of these boxes lying around their houses. Inside these boxes were strange discs, which one would place into their magic boxes, and it would play on the VT. Here's an example of the magic box being used. Once the disc is placed into the magic box, you can watch the video on the VT. These boxes were good for the Nasserimians for a little while, but they also caused a different type of problem. Nazarimian homes were filled with these useless discs now, but with the rise of Zilftin, that fixed that problem because they wouldn't have to go out to the store and buy more of these to take up their space. Instead, they had everything right on Zilftin. Now that Nazarimians didn't have to go to the store and buy a bunch of discs every time they wanted to watch something, they were willing to pay $10 each month in order to keep their rights to Zilftin. Zilftin soon became so important to the Nasseremians that anyone who didn't have it was considered odd. You don't have Zilftin? Yeah, why would I pay for movies when I can just go on Locker Put? This was especially because Zilftin was accessible on all of the different types of magic boxes. From top laps, to eons, and to the VT. The VT was a large flat surface that could show images on it. People had to sit and watch these images for prolonged amounts of time, between the hours of mostly 6 p.m. to 3 a.m. The VT was controlled by a smaller box known as the Etomer. The Etomer was used to choose what the Nasseremians wanted to watch. Zilftin was probably just used as a form of entertainment, but it also could have been a way to spend time with friends and family without any effort. Since Nasseremian lives during the daytime were very busy and filled with pointless tasks like crow and flog, the only times that they had to spend together was during the evenings. There's been some more focused studies on the younger members of the society. They sometimes participated in an activity known as Zilftin and Chill. Not much is known about this part of the ritual because the Nasseremians considered it to be disturbing, but some studies suggest that it may have been a way to attract a mate using Zilftin. Whoever could watch Zilftin for the longest amount of time without falling asleep was the dominant mate. These discoveries prove that Zilftin was more than just a way of entertaining yourself. It was also a way of bonding with others in your family and community. Even though bonding and connecting with others for Zilptin and Chill is a good thing for your community. There are also some negative effects from Zilptin. Staring at the VT for too long is said to cause poor eyesight, and sitting down with lack of exercise for so long and so often could have been one of the factors of the Nasseremia's obesity problems. For students in school, Zilptin was a large distraction since they could watch shows instead of doing homework, and that would lead to falling behind in class and adding more stress. Sometimes, this would cause problems within their family units. If members watched too much Zilftin, then they might run out of the precious data, and they would have to pay a fee. To answer a question from the beginning, what is Zilftin? Zilftin is a way of watching and storing discs all in one place without the use of boxes. Zilftin was used as a way to bond with other people in your family and community, but too much of it led to some health problems for the Nasseremians. 
Our studies have shown that perhaps if the Nasserimians found other ways than just watching Zilfden to spend their leisure time, then perhaps they wouldn't have died from obesity and eye problems.